handle the truth. Hey ladies and gentlemen, welcome back, it's Godan. This is not my fusion event. No, not my fusion event at all. But the fusion event was on today, and it was only for one day, and it's just about over. What's different with this fusion event besides the time? It's hard to have 800 titans for food. It's also hard now to have so many resources. You gotta raid. But the fusion event is still ultimately important, and here's one reason why. And this is why our new infiltrator, Ginsu. And we have a player showcase from Belial 13. It's belated, and I do apologize. A big regret for a little guy. This Titan may be the second best infiltrator out there. He may perhaps even be better than Loki. In the right hands with the right relics and the right level troops. Well, let's take a look at today's player showcase. Belial 13. Thanks again. Here we go. Jin Shu. Now these are stats of another Max Jin Shu. With the right relics. Level 25 maxed. Panthers. Elemental Grasp. How's he going to do this? Let's see. Up the void resist on his cats. I'll take a snapshot of the relic setup to share. But Belial 13, thank you so much for this showcase. Something that we needed to see. Now he's going to use cats. Max ones, of course, unlike how I used archers in that last video. But this is against a Max Osiris. All void. Now I had a hard time with my rat, but let's see what this does. Well, Osiris is already down. The cats seem to be doing well as well, going through all the troops without any major issues. Ginsu is starting to get hurt. I don't know if he's gonna be able to make it through this whole battle. Maybe not, but he's giving his buffs to the cats. He might, no more shield spells. But he's going to work. He's hanging in there and he's still alive. This is what you can do with this Titan. So even though I couldn't display it, this was a perfect display. Known as the rat. And any other So here we go. Jinsu one more time. Why? Because one thing that we concern ourselves with is resources and the loss of troops during raiding. Well let's see what Jinshu can do on a land. Of course it's easier, of course we know where the spawn points are, but you still gotta take care of business. You still gotta do things the right way. Once again, this is against Osiris. Level 25 max troops, not max uh, void resistance, but still, doing the right thing. Uh, drawing out the uh, spawn troops, the Omega troops. Jinshu doing his thing. And actually taking damage and giving it out. If he didn't have that extra X health, he'd already be done for. So that right there is a bonus. Personally, I like equipping maybe one or two relics. Oh, and he's down for uh, health. But really, you want to work on your troops. If you have a troop buff from Titan, you really want to buff those ti buff those troops. But these cats are taking care of business. There's a little bit of glue, a little bit of a mix-up. Going to rage them up. But it looks like the horde doesn't stand a chance. He's just driving through them. A lot of spells he used too, besides rage. It looks like there's no need. Jinshu is not a bad titan. So if you missed out on him, you may want to consider possibly getting him the next go around. Many are saying he's the second best titan after Bass. Well, depending on how things look in the future, he might be even better. We'll have to wait and see. We know that the Horde is the meta. The cats may make a may make a comeback. You never know. But again, thank you, Bilal13, for this display. 
the showcase. Truly appreciate it. And that's a wrap. So as always, relax, enjoy, be balanced, have fun, and take care.